Hello there. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'd like to start off the first of a new line of videos, comic books. I am not the most well-versed in comics. Um, I love them. I read a lot of them, uh, but I do not pretend to know everything about them. I'd like to go over this one with you here. It is the What If, the original Marvel series. Seeing as there is a new series on Disney Plus, the What If series, really enjoyed that, still going as of right now. I actually have only read, I think, a couple of these stories. So I figured, hey, why not, uh, why not start collecting them? I like the, the ones on Disney Plus so much. So here it is. I'd like to go over it with you a little bit. So this is about $100 US. Um, it's an omnibus, which I've, I haven't done videos on before, but I have a decent amount of them. Uh, so I'd like to start going over these with you guys. But this is just a, a, a collection book. Um, which most people, if you're watching these videos, I'm pretty sure you know what this is. I'm just throwing that out there if you don't. But um, Omnibus is one of my favorite ways to collect a series or a collection because it throws in, it puts them in chronological order and pulls from different lines or stories so that you get the whole thing all in one, which is how I, I like to read it. So this is collecting what if... Um, from 1977, number one through 15, and number 17 through 22. So there's a, a bunch of writers in here. W one of them has, has a pretty interesting story. It was, uh, uh, let's see here. What if the original Marvel bullpen had become the Fantastic Four? So it's like Stan Lee, Jack Kirby, Sal Bas Basema, I think, John Basema. It, it's a cool story. It's a really cool, cool story. Yeah, let's take a look at this bad boy. So we have the book here. Uh, this is the, um, what do you call this? The, the cover protector. You got the Spider-Man. What if he joined the Fantastic Four? Be the Fantastic Five, obviously. And then it shows all the the different stories that they have on the back, and then what it collects, which is cool. Writers, prices, number of the book, rating, you know, all that good stuff. And then I'm pretty sure on this inside cover here, so if we take the, the dust cover off, it shows the, the same as the front. Let's be careful. I have already pre-opened this in a, I guess, proper way as I've stretched out or loosened up the, the bindings, which is just you opening it down and then flipping through the pages evenly. Kind of helps relax the, the binding. If you've ever done book binding, it's super cool. But like I was saying, super cool front cover what if volume one and then it's got the the thor lady thor story which is pretty cool so yeah i like that i like that on the inside i like it when it has something so uh i don't want to spoil too much for you here um but i'll just flip through some of these pages so you got what if the original Marvel series, volume one. And it shows writers, pencilers, anchors, all that good stuff, some more. And then the stories. So you got, what if Spider-Man had joined the Fantastic Four? Uh, what if the Hulk had always had Bruce Banner, Banner's brain? That's a lot of bees. Um, what if the Avengers had never been? You know, just cool stories, really interesting. If you've seen the series, you kind of get the gist of what this is is based off of these books so uh flipping through i mean it's it's good uh classic artwork um you got colorful pages 
I mean, it's just, it's a great book to have. That's why I really like these Omnibus. I really like having the color in these, but they're just fun stories, you know, just different. Like this one, I think it was this one. Oh, what if? What if Ghost Rider, Spider Woman, and Captain Marvel were villains? Like it's just interesting, fun, colorful pictures, interesting stories. Good fun. Nice big art pieces. Look at that. Oh man. But yeah, it's a fun book. Really, really cool book. But yeah, I have a lot of fun with these these omnibus. Um formats and even has some of the the old like what are these the letters or the the things in the back of the comics i guess it's cool brings it back not that i was there but yeah I'll check that out stanley mr fantastic this is it's just fun stories it's, re it's really cool so yeah, um, just wanted to share a little bit about this here book. What is this? <laughs> yeah, just cool stories. So yeah, if you liked the um, What If series, You'll definitely enjoy this book. So yeah, there we have Marvel Omnibus What If, the original Marvel series, volume one. Um, I, I honestly, I really love, like I said, I really love this format. I love the colors. I love having the, the colored books. And I love these old stories being collected in huge editions like this. So uh, I'm going to try to do more videos like this where I'm, I'm kind of throwing out uh, new omnibus that, that are coming out or uh, mainly just the omnibus, honestly. Super cool book, interesting stories, great colors. I mean, they just don't make stuff like they used to, honestly. It's, it's great. I love, love these classic old stories very very creative but yeah please uh like and subscribe comment if you want it's up to you you can say something if you want share a little bit of insight if you know more about these stories or cool facts or anything and uh remember be legendary my friends <laughs>